Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Christmas share. Um, this is what I created for uh, Patty, who is Mommy and Me Crafts here on YouTube and on Instagram. Uh, we were part of a hop. Thank you, Janae. Um, happy Mel Obsessed for inviting me. Um, what we had to do was to do a 3D project for ornaments, a project of our choice, um, and uh, ornament, <clears throat> and a store-bought goodie. So I'm only going to share with you guys my, spe my special project and my embellishments. Um, I'll have uh, Patty show the rest of the project. So I created this book and I wanted to do a embellishment book, kind of like telling a story. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, and um, I follow, I think her name is Cutesy Shelf um, here on YouTube. Um, folio tutorial so i'll go ahead and link her information um on the description box um i changed it just a little bit because hers is actually an album and i didn't want to do an album i wanted to stick to an album i mean uh, uh an embellishment book <clears throat> so right here i use the frank garcia candy cane candy cane lane collection i think it's called i'm not sure it's the new one from this year and I used um, pink reds um, tones. I know that Patty likes pinks, but she also liked traditional colors. And this is not something that she told me. I actually went and I hunted out all of her videos just because I wanted to see, you know, what she liked. And I've noticed that she used a lot of traditional colors with a touch of pink. <clears throat> so this is what the book looks like in the outside. Um, and I still have to wrap all of this and send it out. So right here in the front, I used two of the Tim Holtz uh, Nutcrackers. And these are two embellishments. And, <clears throat> and then right here, these are two little doorknobs that are from Hobby Lobby. <clears throat> and then you open it up like so. Make sure I'm on frame. And so right here in the front, I made kind of like a little paper collage of things um, and has like little pockets and I'm gifting her some of these flowers from Hobby Lobby. Um, they're going to go in here. <clears throat> and then, meet, let's see, let's start on this side. On this end, um, I gifted some of these buzzing with bees. I think these are bees. I mean, um, uh, V, not bees. <laughs> I think those are bees. Uh, Veronica buzzing with the um, handmade tassels. And then you guys know that all my projects need to have like some type of zipper embellishment. So that actually does zip down, but it doesn't have anything. I forgot not to glue that. So I apologize about that. And then right here on this side, I did some of these um, mugs from Hobby Lobby. I think these are Momenta um, or Spellbinders. I'm not sure. I got them at Hobby Lobby. And that's one thing that I was a little like <clears throat> concerned about because I kept thinking, I'm like, well, what do I give Patty? Um, I know she's a designer for a lot of these dye companies. So I was really trying to avoid using dyes that she already has. <clears throat> so I tried to work with you know, um, out of, uh, you know, again, companies that she doesn't work with. And so right here, um, it does have like a little um, Velcro. It's supposed to be a magnet, but I didn't have any magnets at the time. And then this star is from, um, it's one of those Spanish lines. It could be Mintopia or it could be Laura by Laura. Laura, Laura by Laura, something like that. So <clears throat> you open it up. And um, I did a bunch of rosettes. These are all Tim Holtz. I didn't want to use, the, again, the, you know, the dyes that I knew she had. So um, these are by Tim Holtz. And these are snowflakes. And then just regular rosettes. <clears throat> and then, I'm sorry, Patty. I did um, pull that a little too hard. 
So right in the middle, <clears throat> and I added, oh, I also added this little trim right here because I thought it was so cute. And then right when you open it, um, I did my two embellishments right here. Um, again, this is from the collection um, Candy Cane. And um, I thought I really wanted to use that deer. So, so that's one um, part of the book. And then right here in the middle, I wanted to use dyes, you know, that I knew that she didn't have. And this, or maybe she does have, but she hasn't used. <clears throat> these are from Tim Holtz. And I believe these are from last year. And I wanted to stick with the colors that the collection had as well. And then right over here on this side, I made two more embellishments. And these are two more nutcrackers. <clears throat> and then... Right here in the middle, um, I have a pocket, and inside the pocket, I'm gifting her um, some sequin mix, so she could do, um, I know that she has this collection, so she could use it with the collection, <clears throat> and then that trim is from Target, and right here, right in the middle, um, I have a star with glitter and it's the same die but in small version that I have in the front <clears throat> and then I wanted to do like a little frame I want to make sure you know um, that it was part of like the Christmas collection so once you open it up it does have that me mechanical <clears throat> turn to it and it just says 25 ho 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 a snowflake and then Dasher, Dancer, the name of all the reindeers, pretty much. Um, so yeah, so I just wanted to show you guys really quick what I created for her. I hope she likes it. I was really nervous to create something for Patty because she's so talented and I honestly did not know what to give her. Um, and then you guys, I, I'm not sure if I'm posting this after her video, but if I am, I'll go ahead and link her. Um, video where she's opening everything up and um, I hope you guys are having a great day thank you so much for watching and until the next time I'll talk to you soon bye